So good morning world. Julia from Adventure Geek today. We're in, we're just outside Rockingham. This orchard is absolutely amazing. Apparently all these trees um, have been grown to actually create cricket bats or so the guy told me. Anyway, we slept really well. It was a bit chilly in the night, um, but apart from that, it was absolutely fine. I've uh, discovered um, something called dry shampoo, uh, which I've never heard of before, but yeah, it feels really nice this morning. Um, so we're just going to pack up, and uh, I think today's... There's <laughs> uh, Today's trip is a short one. We've only got about eight and a half miles, so we'll probably will crack on. Uh, maybe do another stage after that. Otherwise, you know, we'll be tenting up about, I don't know, 10 o'clock otherwise. So, uh, yeah, should be cool. Um, I'll see you in a bit. No one's there. We were never here. Ever. Oh wow, it doesn't do it justice on video. No, I can't get it. Amsterdam's been lonely, so I'm coming to LA. I think this time I just might stay. Will the tongue all change? Rebecca? Mm. Off we go! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, nine o'clock. It's a bit chilly. Everyone's got their gear on. Recheck. Jumpers are back on. Hopefully the rain's gonna stop off. On to the next village. <laughs> <laughs> you big kid. <laughs> you should get out. <laughs> so that was a good pit stop. Four miles in. Next stop is Middleton. I'll see how we get on from there. Sausage and egg baps. That's the way to live. Oh, there she goes. Oh, wow. Good. Stupid dog. An update if you saw that video with the cows. Just to let you know that, um, yeah, the dog, it did get kicked. Uh, had a right old wallop with the back legs of one of those cows. Uh, but I think it uh, shook it off, so... Um, it was absolutely fine. Debbie went in to actually um, rescue the lady because she was in the middle of the of the field with all those cows. Me and, me and Rebecca were by the side thinking, oh my God, I'm gonna, we haven't got to go that way. So, But she was screaming like a good one. But yeah, just to let you know that uh, dogs are okay. And uh, we're now back on, on route. Yeah, bit of an adventure. Falls in love on a little screen. Well, the times they are changing, and the distance only makes us patient. They say the love's forever in the <laughs> Come on, Debbie. <laughs> as long as my heart is the place that you go home. We're stuck in like two fields, we're, we're herding it, we've just got to get it through that fence and then it'll be with all its other sheep friends over there. Oh look, it knows where it's going, that's good. <laughs> Is that, I haven't got the sound on. <laughs> Oh, it's funny, all I've got is you two <laughs> laughing with me. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, so... Window seat on a sunny summer day. Oh, 
Well, I think we're going to go all the way through to that bit over there. made it 16 miles later all right let's see where we're gonna camp for tonight how do you feel guys oh, it's a long old day <laughs> knackered Right, so quick roundup video then. Um, so today was about 15 miles. We're absolutely shattered. <laughs> We're parked on a slope in a fabulous garden in a place called The George, which is in Great Ockenden. Um, so we've had a brilliant meal. It's been absolutely fantastic. Um, bottle of wine and yeah, it's just been great. So say hello, Debs. Night, night, and Rebecca. <laughs> so it's just been great. So anyway, we're so tired. So I'm going to say good night. See you all tomorrow. Bye bye. and falling autumn leaves The birth of us under Christmas trees What a funny kind of way for two people